It's recording now. Very good, Adla. <laughs> we can get started. Oh, wait, I'm not sharing my screen. Let me share my screen. All right. Very good. So let's get started with grammar. What you prepared for today? Let me just put the date here. Today's yeah. the today is the sixteenth. <clears throat> okay, nice. So okay. what about Duolingo? You use Duolingo this week, right? Yes, but I use Duolingo not until animals and until um. How do you name it? Uh, people, and and uh, I, I I don't I don't have a fast and Duolingo because I changed the the account not more uh -huh. plus, uh -huh. and I I don't I didn't get the fast and Duolingo in this in today I I don't know why but ah you couldn't I, you couldn't use it today no but in the last the last days I I used the Duolingo but only until people. And okay. the, I, I, I remember uh, the missing the two lessons for the complete, complete, completely until animals. Until animals. OK, yes. here, right? The, these lessons here. Pessoas em casa, dois animais, yeah? Yes, yes. I stopped it in pessoas. And pessoas. So you made some notes. <clears throat> Is it about, are the notes about Duolingo or something different? Is something the, different? The both, the both, uh, um, yes, have the, the con notes about the Duolingo, but in the Duolingo have uh, the same um, lesson topic. about uh -huh. the topic, about the difference between to do and to make. Ah, and very good. Uh -huh. So, for example, mm. he, so tell me. Uh, mm -hmm. the, dif the difference between to do and the make and the basic, for example, is we used to do for actions, obligations, the repetitive tasks, and yeah. the make, uh, the building or producing or creating something. Yes. And, and, and the, actions that you and choose action. to do. Yes. Uh -huh. But that more interesting for me, it's about the definition and to do generally refers to the action itself. itself. Uh -huh. And make it usually refer to the result. Interesting, interesting. That's an interesting ex way to explain it. Yeah. yeah it's for do, you th do you think this is helping you to understand the difference? Yes, for me it's <laughs> more, more, uh, more easy. Uh -huh. more easy to understand for the difference and uh, when uh -huh. use it to uh -huh. do or to make. But uh -huh. have uh, some exceptions. Uh, uh -huh. in the use, for example, uh, to do at uh, at uh, possible use in the general sport, for example, uh, she mm -hmm. she does sports. So for the specific sport, uh, we use play. So she play basketball as the mm -hmm. specific sport. And <clears throat> yeah. and I I noted here about the common colloc collocation uh -huh. uh, we do I have the housework, work or study, take care of your body, uh, general good or bad actions. In this case, the housework have the exception about the make the bed. Not uh, yes, the exactly. bed, yes, make mm -hmm. the bed. And so you, uh, just a moment, uh, you, okay, I will make dinner. So yes, make dinner. You make a meal yeah. with food like you put here, yeah. right? Make a salad or make dinner. If you do the dishes, if you do the dishes afterwards, okay. And the exception is make the bed, exactly. Yeah. Uh, notice that every time we have the word work, we use do. So we say do or anything kind of related. For example, do the housework, do the homework, do some kind of uh, work, do a good job. Yeah. And also uh, do an exercise, okay? Because this is what uh, students often get wrong. So we do exercises. If I said, did you do the exercises? Yes, I did the exercises. I do the exercises every day. 
Okay. Not only English exercises, any kind of exercise. It's do. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. All right. What else? So taking care of your body. Can you open this envelope? I just did my nails. So to do your nails. Yes. Do your hair. Yes. Uh -huh. And general good or bad actions. Did pretty well. I did well. Uh huh. Did. Okay. Yeah. Very good. And the collocations with make. Uh, in the collocation, I uh, have the food. Uh, I may I make a dinner or I make a breakfast. I make a salad uh, yes. for the family picnic. Yes. Uh, the money. Um, I don't make very much money. Uh huh. And the re relationship. Mm -hmm. uh, for example, they make friends. Uh, yes. They they use. Mm -hmm. uh, the communication, uh, he made a joke. Made uh, a joke, was, yes, he made a joke. Uh -huh. Made a joke. And, and the exception, uh, don't say make a question. And the correct is ask a question. Very good, ask a question. Very good. Because this is from Portuguese. In yes. Portuguese we say this way, but then there is a departure and we say differently in English. It's ask a question, yes. But it's possible uh, uh, ask, for example, uh, I have a question or no? I no. have a question, yes. I oh, have a okay. question is okay. I have a question, but I have a uh, doubt is wrong. It's yes, wrong. It, it, do you understand why? Yes, because the doubt is it's involved in faith. Yeah, very good. Yes. Excellent. And question, have a question, has to do with knowledge. Yes. And doubt has to do with faith. Good job. Knowledge. Just, just and okay. mm -hmm. in the last one, it's about the plan and progress. Mm -hmm. uh, my students are making good progress. Uh, yes. Nice. Some examples. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good, very good. Yeah, so maybe you have felt the, that this might be difficult to remember right remember everything because it's a lot of information yes. you already have some references here but you will remember by <clears throat> uh, practice, uh, practicing the language by reading listening writing and speaking and also by going over the grammar every now and then go back go back go back in the future yes. right wait a moment and um, uh, a few months in the future, go back to the topic, review it. Every time we review, the knowledge settles a bit more and we go a bit deeper, deeper than usual. So it helps. Okay, nice. Okay. Any questions and comments so far? No, no. It no? is the difference between to do it and to make it. I listen and express in English. I have to ah, look. okay, nice. Yes, I love this site. <laughs> Yes. Some of my favorite 60 collocations with doing me. Yes, nice. have nice. many collocations. Yeah, very good. What about uh, Duolingo? So, what does Duolingo say about doing make? Uh, and the Duolingo is more simple. Uh, it's only about for to do as more common for describe <laughs> activities and uh -huh. to make it means to build and to produce or to create. Uh -huh. And I have some example that he makes uh -huh. dinner. And I do my homework. Yeah, so again, uh, here you have make a meal and do work, work. some kind of work. Yes. Yeah. And the exception is about the to play uh, uh -huh. for a specific sport mm -hmm. and to do general sport. It should have the sport, they play football. Uh, it, it's possible to use, we have a picnic every week. And oh, yeah. make it uh, make sense uh, about the to do. Yes. Yes, we have a picnic. Very nice. So do a sport, do a sport and play a specific sport. When you name the sport, uh, play uh, volleyball, play tennis, especially when you have a ball and there are two teams involved. But you can also say do, oh, it's not exactly a sport, but do yoga, uh, do karate, do judo. Right, you have the words play, do, and go. And you use go with, this is extra, right? This is like go skiing, go skating, go roller skating, etc. Okay. All right, uh, what about, so we skip this, weather. What does Duolingo yeah. say about the weather? 
and whether at only the comparison about, uh -huh. for example, in Portuguese, uh, at common use the quente or faz calor, yes. and but in English as it's hot. It's it hot, is, yeah, yeah. It's actually okay. close to this uh, phrase está in quente. Portuguese. Está quente, né? Yes. Because está is it's it's hot. Yes. So. Yeah. Yeah, it's important not to confuse with fast, not, not, not try to translate this verb, but this one here. Okay. Yes. So it's hot, it's cold, it's humid, it's dry. Yes, mm -hmm. it's sunny. Sunny? It's sunny, yeah, very good. Very nice. Okay, back to number three, places. Yes, it's place uh, 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 also uh, the comparison for the Portuguese, because in Portuguese we use perto do, or mm. something, or atrás do alguma coisa, só me think. In English, uh, the the museum uh, is near the zoo, near yes. the zoo. Mm -hmm. And for example, the car is behind the hotel. Or Brazil is near Colombia. Yes, yes. No, uh, like, I, like I, yeah, like I told you, Duolingo selects uh, yeah. grammar points that we Brazilians have problems with. So this is a problem because we tend to translate directly from perto do zoológico to uh, something else in English that doesn't work. In English, it's different again. So exactly this, near something, near something, near the zoo, near Colombia, near the hotel, right? We need to, or behind, behind the hotel, same thing, same idea, very nice. Plural, what does it say about the plural form? Uh, the plural, uh, it's about the word finish in you. Why? 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 Uh -huh. uh, we, you need to change for you. Why? For the e ES. Yes. I, 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 yes. I, yes. Yes. I, for yes. example, university, universities. Yes. City, city. Uh -huh. And have the exception about the Portuguese. In Portuguese, mm -hmm. uh, we say todas as universidades. In English, is how universities. Yes. Don't all? they use the, the all? Yes. Universities. universities. Yes, all universities. Very nice. Is this new information or is a re was it a review for you? The exception is the new information. Ah, uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Nice. Because I translate literally. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. This helps us to watch out and be careful when yeah. it's the same as in Portuguese and when it's different. Right? It's important to know the differences. Uh, restaurants. What does it say about restaurants? It's about for the add something. For example, uh, can I have a drink? Mm -hmm. And not use bring. As mm -hmm. can I have something? Yes. And the uh, way more polite. Yeah, uh, I would like to wine, please. Yeah, I would More like wine. some wine, right? Some wine or a glass of wine, <clears throat> glass of wine, a bottle of wine or something. Okay, because you can say also, uh, I would like to drink wine, please. You can say that. So here you have to, well, actually the whole thing is would like to plus verb and here you don't have the two and you have the noun do you see the difference so i would yes. like some okay. wine i would like to drink okay nice okay. numbers uh, yes have the numbers the different uh no the numbers about the a 80 yeah. 90 yeah. A, a 100 yeah um, i believe that the new new settings. I yeah, I, I just want to show you, I don't know if you did that, but uh, did you use two phonetics with these words? It's nice to visualize the way they are yeah. pronounced, yeah. right? So here you have, see, we see all these letters and say, oh, this is so hard to pronounce. But when you see the phonetic symbols, it's so easy, right? 80. <clears throat> and I, I'm saying the T like a D, 80, 80. But it could be said uh, 80, 80, right? Too. And here, how do we say this word? 90. Yeah, 90, 90 with a D sound or 90. Both 90. are fine. 90. So 80, 90. Yes. All right. Mm -hmm. Pronunciation. Yes, because um, the difference is the 15. Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. and the team is more long. Yes. And fifty, fifty, and the the sound of T usually sounds more like D. Yeah, especially in American English, right? So it's yes. putting it here just on fifty, just to visualize once more the difference. So here we have, see, the mark of the stress syllable is here. So we'll say 15, 15, right? Yeah. And here, this the mark is in the beginning. The stress mark is in the beginning. So it's 50, 50. 50. Good job. All right. And people. Uh, if people as the different uh, in the plural, in the plural, because yeah. a man. Uh, at the sing singular uh -huh. and the plural as man. Okay. A woman, mon woman, child, children, person, and people. Yeah, this uh, one here. This one here again. A woman. Woman, woman. Yeah, here. It's, uh, yeah, almost that. Just to to make sure. Let me just put here because this can be. I think it's better when we see the symbol. So. Here again, we have man, 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 and man. You're going to see the, the vowels in the future in the series. I'm not going to talk a lot about this now. But here, the, the difference is big because here it sounds like a U and here E, right? Yeah. Yes. So, woman. woman, yes, woman, woman and women. Women, good job. Woman, women. And here it's easy to see child. Right? Yes, child, children. Children, good job. And here? Person. Person, yes. People. People. Good job, yeah. All right. And the comparison. Oh, we saw so many things. <laughs> so, comparison. Yes, what? the my brother is taller than me. Uh -huh. And my sister is nicer than me. Mm -hmm. It's so, a comparison. comparison. Yeah. So the adjective is tall, tall. Yes. If you want to compare two people, you need to add ER to the word, right? So taller than, I had to, to add this word here, taller than. So ER means mais, né? mais alto mm -hmm. do que, taller than. And here's the same thing, but here we add only the R because the E is already there. So nicer than. Mais legal do que, né? Mais simpático do que. Very nice. Any questions or any other comments about no. this part? No. Very no. nice job, Ed. Okay. So, pronunciation now. So, you practice yeah. voiceless consonants eight. The last voiceless consonant. This one here. Yes. And this sh. sh. Very good. Very good. Yes. Sh. That's the sh sound. Uh, this is a sound that we have in Portuguese. Uh, yeah, right. We the have. Height. Yeah, this is normal for us, so it's it shouldn't be a problem. Uh, can you read the words for me? Yeah, ship, uh -huh. shore, fish, nation, shush. It's shush. It's shush. shush. Yes, yeah, so it's very good. And the contrast between and the different sh is and very good. So. Show, uh -huh. so, yes, shy, shy, yeah, ship, sip, uh huh. This is more difficult. Uh, chauffeur, yeah, it's this word here, it's starting with sh, chauffeur, chauffeur, sofa, yeah, because remember that this series is British, it's a British series, oh, so the pronunciation okay. is different. If we put it here onto phonetics, you see that if we choose. Um, the British pronunciation. Let's see what happens. It's the same. See, the only difference is the first sound. Okay. So that this is a minimal pair. This is chauffeur and so yeah, sofa. sofa. Yeah, in British English. But look okay. in American English. Let's see if it's the same. It's not. In American English, it's chauffeur. With the R at the end, chauffeur, chauffeur actually, sorry. Oh, actually, th there are two, two ways to pronounce it. You can say 
chauffeur or chauffeur. Okay, there are okay. these both these two ways. And this one is still sofa, same thing. Okay, sofa. so in uh, British English, this is chauffeur. Chauffeur. Okay. Comments, chauffeur. questions, problems? No, no, that's okay. Very nice. Okay, so the story that you read is this one using levels. Yeah, but the, I don't have more time because I have more tool history. Oh, yeah, really? Yeah, it's below. Mm -hmm. Oh, very nice. Okay. So, this. Uh, so, uh, yes. Emotions of dogs is not uh, here, right? Yes, it's the uh, area, yeah, not here. Uh, okay, so can you tell me? Yeah, uh, it's possible. Okay. Um, Before you start, Edla, did you do levels one, two, and three, or only level three? Yes. No, now uh, only level three because the last week I I study at the level one and two. Ah, okay. Did you watch the video? Yeah, that's very cool. <laughs> very cute. So tell me, what did they find out? Uh, it's about the uh, study uh, or where the the dogs uh, change the the expression and direct response to human attention. Mm -hmm. Um. And have the study for twenty four dogs uh, mm -hmm. of various breeds, and uh, the doctor who led the study believe uh, the dog's expression uh, are a result of domestication. Mm -hmm. It's more about that. Um, yes, yes. Do you have a dog? Yes, I have one dog. One ah, Shih Tzu. Okay. Ah, okay. So. Do you think that your dog changes her or his? Is it a f is it female or male? He is. He is. Do you think what is his name? A Mimo. Mimo? Yes. Mimo. Do you think Mimo changes his expression? Yes. It's when you fun. look when you look at him. <laughs> yes. At the I look like they listen to me uh, and understand uh, what the did I say? And you think that he produces more expressions when he knows that you are looking at him? Yes. Yeah. So yes. If, if he knows, I believe. Yes, I believe that they, <laughs> they study. <laughs> you believe you? It makes yes, sense. Yes, I believe. It makes sense. Yes, for me, yes. Uh huh. So one dog, one dog walker. Uh, what did this dog walker say? He was interviewed, and what did he say? One dog a worker um, as the the dog um, and the people uh, the the person the need of the dog. Yeah, but uh, he noticed that his dogs express what? A uh, true emotion, mm -hmm. uh, and the, it's possible I noticed the uh, its dog is scared or uh, the the. <laughs> not recognizing the, the the person. I think it wasn't me. I'm scared, yeah. right? I'm scared. Like the dog is really feeling scared, and f it, this is a fake one. So it, it, when the dog looks at you as if saying, "Oh, it wasn't me," like there is something wrong, like a a roll, a destroyed um, uh, how do you call that? Uh, toilet paper. <laughs> you see a <laughs> roll of toilet paper all around the house, and then you look at your dog, and the dog looks at you. Oh, it wasn't me. <laughs> <laughs> Does your dog do that? It wasn't me. Uh, yeah. Um, yeah, some uh, sometimes, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, and people previously thought the dog expressions dog, were involuntary, yeah. emotional. Uh, emotional displays. But they are calculated well, attempts attempt. to communicate. Okay. Very good. Uh -huh. So the breed, your dog's breed is Shih Tzu. Shih Tzu. Yes. Mm -hmm. Ah, very nice. How old is your dog? Four years. Four years old. And yeah. did you did you train your dog to do things or no? No. no. I, I train about the um, how do you say Shishi? Mm. I don't know. And this uh, the P. P P and the on the carpet, on the carpet. 
and the carpets. Uh -huh. And they add the, the uh, exclusive cap carpet for, uh -huh. for him. Ah, and okay, the, okay. I mm -hmm. trained that and I did, uh, the, the, he, drink, he ate his drink, uh -huh. the water, and the, in the bowl. Uh huh. Nice. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That, that that's okay for uh -huh. for him. That. And he learned that. Yes. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Uh, and the pee and the and the odor is the the carpet and the drink of the uh, water and the bowl. Mm, the bowl. Nice. And did you have any other dogs before, uh, Mimo? Yes. Yes. I have the the husk. Siberia. Wow. And I how do you name the pastor? Black pastor? I don't no, know. A I have German the... Shepherd. German Shepherd. É um pastor alemão? A German. Não, era um pastor negro. Ah, eu já não sei. Eu sei que pastor <laughs> alemão é German Shepherd, but I don't know. Uh, but did you notice the same things in these other dogs that you had? That and yeah, the husky Siberian, yes. Uh -huh. um, and the in the order the the German German I don't uh -huh. know. Uh, Let's I, try to find it. Not 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 much. Uh, in English, ne? In English. But eh, que tá falando pastor alemão? Será que é pastor do Caucas? Well, era diferente desse? Was it different? Yes, it's an only black. Uh, okay. it, mm, ah, like this one here. Like mm, this one. It, Manto negro. Okay. Right, uh, this one? Yes, yes, that's the same. Ah, let's try this one. Manto negro. Less, less time. Let's try this. Shepherd black. I, I'm, not, I'm not sure. This is uh, translation. By Google, maybe. Well, they don't say. Um, oh, maybe it's Shepherd German. Yeah, German Shepherd generally. Ah, black German Shepherd maybe. Uh huh. So, but they are all very smart. These breeds are very smart. Sorry. Uh, these breeds are very smart, very intelligent. Yes, mm -hmm. but for me, uh, that more uh, intelligent is. I don't, I don't know the name, uh, the Fox Polishing. Uh, I don't oh, know Fox any. Fox Polishing, uh, I don't know. Either. Let's see if we can find that. The most intelligent. Yes. The most in intelligent. Um, Brazilian Terrier. Brazilian Terrier. Ah, yeah, okay. Brazilian, Brazilian Terrier. terrier. Uh-huh. Ah, okay. And the most intelligent uh, than the other breeds. Yeah, so... Uh, Brazilian Terrier is more intelligent more than intelligent. the other yes. breeds, right? So here in the comparison, it would be, would be something like this. So Brazilian Terrier is more intelligent than the others. And uh, you can also say Brazilian Terrier and is the most, the most intelligent. Uh, breed okay. something like that okay it's more more intelligent than the most intelligent okay uh, very nice uh, what are new words oh do you understand these these letters here uh, uh, only after the the listen mm -hmm. because in the, the first moment I, I don't understand uh -huh. But do you but understand they, what it means? What does it mean in Portuguese? Um, it, do you yeah. remember? Here it means. É, como, é, tipo, that é, is. Significa que quer dizer. When isso. you're going to, when you want to clarify something, explain uh, using other words, explain with more detail. You say. Quer dizer, so quer dizer means that is. That is. But the that is, these two letters, they are from Latin, the Latin, and they mean id est. Id est, okay? So when we read this, uh, like, where is it? 
Id. Oh, here. Id est. Okay. And it est is from Latin, and it means that is in English, and quer dizer in Portuguese. Okay. 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 The other words are they okay? They are similar to Portuguese. Involuntary. Attempt is not similar, right? Attempt on no. a tentativa, right? Yes. Okay. Anything else that you learned? Other new words? Oh, the new words have the otherwise. 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 Excellent. Um, um, yes, I believe that. That's it? Uh, okay. All right. Uh, however, nice. it's common. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice. Okay, so let's move on now and talk about the next one. The next one is uh, short. Oh, nice! I like this short kid stories. Yes. Oh, but the unicorn is the, uh, yes. And only the paragraph. Uh huh. Paragraph. Good. Paragraph. Oh, nice, paragraph. nice. Mm -hmm. um, the unicorn and his friends. So, can you tell me? To start? Yeah, yeah. I, I, I thought they, they read. It's possible. To read? Yeah, sure. Yes, okay. Um, uh, uh, during the flight, uh -huh. Poppy told Elna how about Isotopia. Uh -huh. Isotopia. 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 Okay. Uh -huh. Elna became friends with Isotopia too. Uh -huh. Suddenly, Poppy and Isotopia noticed that Elna was descending to the ground and had brought them to a strange place. They were in very bright light, uh -huh. so they closed their eyes. Uh -huh. When they opened their eyes again, they they saw that they had reached reached a, reached uh -huh. a huge castle. Excellent. Glisten, uh huh. Listen and go, golden light. Uh mm -hmm. Poppy and Isotopia couldn't believe their eyes. Uh -huh. Poppy asked Eono, "Where have you brought us?" Eono said. This castle belonged to my parents. Mm -hmm. Where are they? Asked it's pop. They are probably, probably, probably no more for mm -hmm. all I know. Mm -hmm. One day he had gone to the forest about six months back and mm -hmm. never returned, answered on a sad voice. Very nice. So you practiced this? Yes, yes. <laughs> ah, very good. Did you practice with two phonetics? Yes. Ah, I can notice that because of, I know because of castle. Yes. Your pronunciation castle. is perfect, perfect. Castle. And the glistening. Glistening. So you saw that we don't pronounce the T, right? Yes, no. Glistening, castle, very nice. And also, all the verbs, all the regular verbs in the past. Yes. For example, uh, which ones? Closed, opened, okay. reached. What and else? The more reached. Yeah, but the pronunciation is perfect. Perfect. Really great job. Great, great job. Yes. Uh, these are the okay. hardest parts. Sorry? And they, they use the uh, voiceless consonants. Yes. Mm -hmm. For example, the, the, where? The, that, there. Uh, there. 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 Uh -huh. Yes. There, there it is. is. Ah, okay. The, you mean the TH? Yes. Uh huh. Yeah. So this one is voiced, right? They. Let me see they, if I can. The, um, oops. No. Not what I wanted to do. Let me try again. Because it didn't copy. Just this. Let me try one more time. Oh. Um, no. Yes. Oh. 
Yeah, yeah. so here you can see uh, there, right? There. there. Remember that this is an E sound. A gente tenta entender falar E, E, mas é E, there. There. It's different in the word. Yes. Uh -huh. Let's try to here. find. Can you find a, wor uh, a word? A word with they, word. With they were at the second line. They. They were. They were. Yeah. 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 Uh huh. This is in inverted, right? So it looks back. Yes. So it's were. Were here and there. Here. It's a lot of there. There. <laughs> yes. Right. This. They, the, etc. Wonderful job! Fanta did you like practicing your pronunciation with two phonetics? Yes, it's very good. It's very in good. This, in, the, in this test, the uh -huh. specific test, it's very uh, different because have something different for the, the, the test. What do you mean? Uh, it's very... The, 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 Difficult words. Ah, they... difficult words. Yes, definitely, yes. <laughs> definitely. Yes. But see, the difficult, uh, the words may be difficult because first you don't know the meaning, and second you don't know the pronunciation. But you can solve the two problems with a dictionary and with two phonetics, and then it's not hard anymore. It's not hard. You were saying castle so naturally, so naturally, <laughs> castle glistening glistening is a word we don't usually use in our everyday lives right so but your pronunciation is awesome awesome i'm impressed really great eyes with a z sound so it makes a difference and it's fast i recommend using this every time every class i say the same thing to all the students open to phonetics and leave it open on your computer all day long and every text word expression in english you come across put here and check it out check the pronunciation to make sure it's what you expect or if it's something different many yeah. times it will be different even for me sometimes i see words that i thought i was pronouncing right but it was not recently today Oh my God, what was the word today? Uh, there was a word uh, today with an S, E, S, A. I forgot, I forgot. But I was pronouncing the S as a Z and it's not that. I forgot the word, maybe I'll remember later. It's worthwhile, vale a pena. Because in one week you're pronouncing words that would be difficult, you know, but uh, they sound really, really great. Very good job. Edla, uh, can you tell me a bit more about this story? I don't know, or would you like to go on to the next one? Green. Yeah, oh, yeah. tell me. A, uh, go ahead. <laughs> yeah, I, I prefer to the, speak about the TV show. Green. Okay, cool. Go ahead. Green. Leaf. Yeah. I, I'm writing the, the summary about the, the TV show, but I don't know if you correct the, the writing. Oh, so you wrote this, right? Yes. Okay, let me yes. correct first. I'll try to, to do it fast. Okay, and no then, problem. Uh, so, if the TV show exhibit... Uh, on. How do we pronounce... Ah, uh, okay. You can say exhibited, but it, it just on. On? Okay. Press okay. channel. It's it is for fourth season now. On Netflix there are there oops, there are only three seasons. Okay. How many seasons did you watch? <laughs> All of them? Uh, all of them? Yeah. Okay. What's interesting for me is that this TV show has its cast. I don't know. Tell me about it and then I'll correct the rest because I want to hear from you. Okay? I will correct as you yes. tell me. Anything? Yes. Can you hear me? Hello? Then I it's, breaking. it's breaking a little. Erica? Yes, I'm here. I think the connection. Erica? Hello? 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 Oi. Oh, we're hi. back. You're back? Okay. Okay, so tell yeah. me about the show, please. 
Uh -huh. Yes. Uh, the good leaf uh, is which about the religion uh, and the story of the good leaf family and the uh, and consider the, st the standards of excellence of the community. Uh -huh. So, um, I, 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 um, how do you say that? Um, the, the, the room, the la largest church uh -huh. in the city is the name is Calvary. Calvary, Calvary, Calvary. In, Calvary. Calvary. Mm -hmm. in Portuguese is Calvario. Uh -huh. Um, and the I would compare the church uh, with with what the universal universal church is, is mm. he in Brazil. Uh -huh. so, so the the how of the history is about the the church, um, mm. and and your family and the other people neighborhood. Uh -huh. And the and really approach the corruption and the more delicate the delicate uh, issue uh, the uh -huh. faith uh -huh. um the pedophilia pedophilia pedophilia, pedophilia. Mm -hmm. yes um have the power games uh, within the family um, mm -hmm. defining and more uh a son than the older mm -hmm. and prejudice mm -hmm. um lgbt for example for mm -hmm. example Mm -hmm. Very nice. So it's a. Uh, what about the characters? Tell me a bit about the characters, about some parts, because you've watched three seasons. So some yes. events that you remember. Uh -huh. uh, the first season is about the return uh, Mondoro, uh, of the family, uh, the returning of the, the city uh, because your new sister. Uh -huh. or, yeah. New sister, irmã nova? Ah, não, irmã mais nova, younger sister. Younger sister, uh, the, the, the die, and the, the diet, and the, your, your sister in her turn for the city, only about that, but don't uh, come back for the New York, because she resolved uh, um, understand what happened uh, uh, with your, your sister, uh, her sister. Her sister, so, very good. Mm -hmm. And the and the, this moment, uh, the the daughter, the woman, uh, mm -hmm. figure out about the pedophilia. Pedophilia. Ah, pedo, pedophilia. Pedophilia. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. And the fourth season is about pedophilia. Um, some some uh, some some episodes. Uh, it's about the corruption too. Um, and the second season is about the the power games. Um, uh, with the the family. Uh -huh. Um, one the the interest about the sons, the child. It's about the who uh is owning the church, the the preggy about the church and so the, the, the family has a church has a business yes and, and uh, the business of the family at the church um, uh, and they, but they, are, yours... are they pastors are they yes are they, yes uh, the parents are the pastors yes the mother and the father is the pastor uh, uh, how, how how the family is working in the in the church uh-huh uh -huh. they, so they have different the... positions Yes, uh, the bishop, the father is the bishop on the bishop, of the church. Bishop, 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 bishop. Uh huh. How many people are there in the family? It's the father, the mother, a three, four, four children. Sons? Children, yes, four, four children, children, but uh -huh. one uh, is died. Died. Faith. Faith died mysteriously. Faith. Yes, it's suicide, but okay. <laughs> okay, and wow, well, so it's very tragic, and uh, there is a lot of mystery and drama, right? It's a drama and mystery. Yeah, show. but it, it's very um, uh, some some summaries uh, compared for these TV shows. Uh, the the same 
uh, environment and the university church here in Brazil. Mm. Oh, okay. What are some, uh, so you said that it's similar to universal church here. What is similar and what is different? Oh, I, I, I read about the, for example, the corruption, uh, it's uh -huh. the similar, but mm -hmm. I, I don't know. I, I, I don't know the history in the university of Turtle and the, and the abuse, abuse, abuse of the faith, abuse of the faith of the people. Mm, I see. Okay. Uh-huh. Yes. Oh, okay. So here and, we have, uh-huh. And the difference, I, I don't know. I don't know why I, I hope have many different, but I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Um, and uh, do you remember other, if, uh, is there like uh, every, because sometimes in the, sh in the seasons, you have one story that develops throughout the season. It starts in the begin in the first episode and ends in the last episode. And some, and there are some shows in which you have a closed story in each episode is a closed story. Mm -hmm. In this one, is it, um, one story that covers all the how many episodes are there per season uh, uh 30 or 50 or 16 16 right yeah because the total is 42 episodes yeah. so uh-huh mm, but okay. at the at the history it's closed about the family uh not mm -hmm. only uh um, not only the pe person but the uh the the involved more people uh, in the family on the family. Uh -huh. for example you of course there are characters from the congregation right other people yes, working have. Uh -huh. yes yeah the con uh -huh. uh, the congregation the 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 meetings about the how do you say dizimo uh, oh, I don't know <laughs> let's <laughs> check that I actually I've seen this before but I forget uh, in Tips? English. Um, I'm not sure. Let's let's check Lingui. Let's use Lingui. Maybe, yeah. Let's do tithe. Ah, oh, it's tithe. Okay. Yeah, tithe. Oh. I don't know because uh. it's connected to tenth, right? Tenth. Jismo has to do is the tenth part of tenth. I don't know the salary or something. So and, tithe. Yes. Mm -hmm. okay. In this part, it's mm -hmm. more involved with corruption because mm -hmm. involved with the money. Mm-hmm. I see. Um, well, it's on Netflix. No. Yes. It's not, right? yes. It is. Netflix. Ah. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Okay. I was trying to watch it too. Exciting. <laughs> ah, then yeah. we can talk more about it. <laughs> but you finished all the seasons. What are you going to watch now? Do you have I don't seasons? know. No. I oh, don't know yet. I don't have an idea. Well, I, 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 I thought and started, started the bait motel, but. Uh -huh. I I only think that, but not don't start. Okay, I watched uh, American Crime Stories. I there are two seasons. I watched uh, the People Against O.J. Simpson, oh. and I liked it a lot. And now I'm watching Versace. Uh, you know, Versace the, have it in Netflix. Yeah, it's the second season. It's on Netflix too, of American mm -hmm. Crime Story, and uh, it's interesting. It's interesting. I like it. Okay. Very nice, Adla. Wonderful class. I love that. Good job. Uh -huh. So keep it up. Uh, I um, corrected the text here. You can take a look and we can comment on it next class. But that's exactly it. Okay, that's the format we're going to, to do for the okay. next classes. All right. Very good. We're going to, t to stop here. Thank you so much. I hope you have a good week. I'll see you next class. Okay. okay? See you. See you. Bye bye. Bye.